Hello people, welcome back to Follow That Fixes this time. So I had a problem whereby my Mac trackpad, it, the click just stopped working. And the issue for me, I'll go through how I solved it and then some alternatives. But basically I'd seen this message on the battery, which you can get to you by the top, the battery icon saying service recommended on the back on the battery and I kind of ignored it which was a bad thing because what can happen is basically your battery once it reaches end of life so it can start swelling and basically that swelling means that it was pushing up against the trackpads here on my MacBook Air it was pushing up against the trackpad meant that the click didn't work and obviously this is an extreme example I didn't get to that stage for me but I took it into a repairer they replaced the battery, adjusted the screw for the trackpad, and then, boom, my battery issue was solved. So here, no longer got that service warning, and thankfully, I was able to click again. So, happy days. So that's what solved it for me. Yes, it cost me a bit of money to fix it, but at least it's fixed. So here's also a temporary workaround that you can do. Obviously, you can attach a mouse. I mean, so you need to get that battery issue sorted basically, but there's a couple of workarounds. So you can attach a mouse and then obviously you can point, drag, etc. all the great things that you can do with a mouse to effectively replicate what you can do with your trackpad. The other thing is change some of the gestures. So go to tap to click, so then you're just using the tap. So my trackpad was still working, it was just the click that wasn't. So I could do tap to click, brings up the one click, or click to tap with two fingers. So no, no longer that bottom right that I use, when the click is working, but tap to click. There you go. I do bottom right corner when the when the click is working, but yeah, you can do that to click. And the other thing for drag, I mean it really is quite painful to use, but it kind of works, is go into accessibility and then you'll see on here point of control, mouse and trackpad, trackpad options. There's this really kind of painful thing you can do. Enable dragging with three finger drag takes up quite a bit of practice to get your fingers used to it but that kind of works as a workaround but obviously you need to get that battery issue fixed unless it's something even simpler so let's just have a look at a couple of the other things that I've seen on the internet when I was researching it so you obviously the classic restart also make sure that you're not connected to a bluetooth mouse so just go to your bluetooth at the top are there any peripheral mouses that are on there that are basically interfering with your trackpad I and mean, it's a possibility chance are you know that the other one is resetting your system management controller so if you're on an intel powered hold for 10 seconds those buttons if it's a t2 security chip hold those buttons but basically those if that's not your mac then obviously you need to google how to do that smc and let others know in the comments what might have worked for you like i said it was a battery issue for me thankfully it's fixed